you always need to make your payments on time. If you falter in that, it will affect your credit score, and I think people forget about that sometimes. A credit score is based on your past history, whether you've had loans at other institutions, if you have credit cards. A good score will indicate to a lender that you handle your financial affairs correctly and that you would be a better risk. When you go to buy your first car or your home, if you haven't established credit in the past, you may need a co-signer. You could pay a higher rate if you're even approved. Not having a good credit score is one of the reasons that you could be denied for a loan. A good credit score would be anything in the 700 and above area. A credit score that would be worked on would be anything 600 or below. Late payments will be negatively affecting your score. Um, if you have collection items, that will also affect your score, whether it be a medical collection or you've forgotten to pay a, a bill and they've put a small claim against you. Bankruptcy is also a negative indicator. The number one thing to improve your credit score would be to always make your payments on time. One way to help with that is to set up automatic payments so that you don't have to remember to make your payment. One other thing to be cognizant of is the utilization rate is what it's called. And what that is is how much you have advanced on your credit card or your line of credit. And if that amount is too high, that's a negative indicator. Try to keep a 10% utilization rate or below. One thing that I think is important is for everyone to take advantage of being able to have their credit report every year. Request your credit from all three bureaus. You can also then review it so that you can see if there's anything that is an error or you think might be negatively affecting your score. Check with one of the retail advisors about the product we have called Fraud Scout, which helps with identity theft and monitoring your credit as well. It doesn't happen overnight and it doesn't get fixed overnight either, but by making your payments and keeping your credit limits in, in line with the amount that you have advanced, then that does help your score.